Never forget that the reason why combination KFC Taco Bell Pizza Huts exist in the first place is because Pepsi couldn't compete with Coca-Cola in the fast food marketplace. See, for the longest time, Pepsi's unofficial slogan was, is Pepsi okay? Because everyone was ordering Coke. So every restaurant was turning Pepsi down. Pepsi took a look at the numbers and realized it was cheaper to buy three fast food chains than to actually compete in the marketplace with Coca-Cola. So that's what they did. They bought KFC, Taco Bell, and Pizza Hut. So once they got those together, they started running them as a division of Pepsi. After a while, they spun that off as its own company called Yum Brands. But if you go to any of those locations, they still only carry Pepsi. Young Brands turned around and looked at the fact that they had three restaurants that all served Pepsi and realized it would be cheaper to go ahead and combine a couple of these restaurants so then they don't have to have as many physical locations to be able to still encapsulate a market. They thought that idea was so much so genius and how much money they would save from not having locations that they then took those savings and used that to lobby both the federal government in Washington and all of your fun state governments to make sure that the minimum wage was kept low, to make sure that they could keep paying people dirt wages so that way they could keep saving money and giving that money back to their shareholders. Which is the reason why today, when I wanted fucking Taco Bell, the goddamn lobby was closed because nobody wants to work at Taco Bell for fucking minimum wage. Because it's 725 in fucking Pennsylvania. The minimum wage in Pennsylvania is 725 an hour. And I just wanted a fucking Mexican pizza. But nobody was there to work. To keep the fucking lobby open. And I don't want to eat a Mexican pizza in my car. It smells like shit, but it tastes delicious. Hey, never.